Right? You think, mister? Hey! We haven't seen your face around here before, bud. Well, you're a pig, so I don't care. I don't care about your opinion. Are you all alone or what? You must feel pretty lonely walking around a place like this all by yourself. What are you doing anyway? I'm trying to talk to your leader. Yeah! Yo, bud, you got a problem with those kill bees, huh? Do ya? Don't tell me it's that annoying hag of a teacher again, is it? You came here to give us a talk or two, because Miss Marie asked you to, right? Yeah, I'm just the messenger. Tell us not to skip school, right, bud? We'll tell us not to be tardy, right, bud? <laughs> oh my god. Well, forget about all that. We're we're the mighty and invincible gang of the four. Killer bees! Do you think we'd listen to a chump like you? Dude, I've got a sword and I'm not afraid to use it. I'll fuck your shit up. Okay. <sighs> that was so superfluous. But I'll, I'll tell you what, bud. If you want to challenge us to a competition, then we'll, then, uh, then we'll think about maybe listening for a little bit. Oh, you'd be happy to oblige, would you? What do you say, bud? You want to challenge us? I'll take you on. <laughs> what kind of challenge do you have in mind? Okay, your funeral, bud. The rules are simple. We're gonna go hide somewhere, and if you find us, we're gonna run. You gotta keep try to catch us. Easy as that, bud. Easy as pie. We won't hide indoors or nothing, and we won't even leave the island. So look for us around in the shadows and behind buildings and stuff. If you catch all four of us, we lose. You got it, bud? Ready? Go! Oh my god, and Link's just looking around, he's like, Damn, I don't know where to start. This island is so big. And this guy's got a toupee. I think I pointed that out last time, so it's not as funny. Alright, the first guy that you're going to want to find is in here. Dude! Okay, I'll, I'll listen to your tale this time, just so you'll leave me alone. Ooh, my sweet, sweet daughter. My only daughter. Poor Maggie. She was captured by a bunch of villains and taken to the Forsaken Fortress. What on earth could those scoundrels want with her? And just what are they? And are they just roaming around looking for young maidens? Are they just evil creatures who delight in mischief? Well, crud! Having a kidnapped daughter doesn't get you a single rupee, you know. <laughs> Ellipses. Please, please save my poor daughter. I beg of you. Here I stand begging. Okay, Mr. Mask Sales. What are you doing now? I don't even. Okay. Look, I just don't. The action that he's doing right now is what I mean. I hope you'll give those scoundrels in the Forsaken a good scare. In the Forsaken, a good scare. They'll pay for what they've done. Oh, yes. Pay. Oh, they're gonna pay, are they? Are they gonna pay? They have to pay off their debt? Pay off their debt to Yvonne Von Hosenberg? Alright, yeah. But here's the leader, and he's gonna run away, just like he said. He wasn't screwing around. He's actually gonna do it. So it's basically a combination here of hide-and-seek and tag. Dude! Shut up! Okay, I'm trying to catch this guy, and you're just messing with me. Wait, where'd he go? Dude, I, I lost him. Oh my god. I lost the little, the little bastard. <laughs> it's all your fault, Anton. The esteemed Anton. <laughs> okay, this is... Wait, I hear him. I hear him go, yeah! I heard that, yeah! Oh, there he is. Oh, catch him, catch him. Wait, don't run to the bar. Okay. I was about to say, you're a bit too young to be going there, buddy. Right. Wait, what? Dude, I just lost him again. Holy shit. I've never seen anything like this. There he is. God, he's so small compared to everyone else. Finally. Yorg, you got me. Yeah, but it took long enough. Jeez, I've never seen anything that pitiful in my whole life. I lost him twice. This is supposed to be really easy, too. Alright, here's the uh, blue hair kid. This guy's name might, might be Jade or something. I know actually a lot more names than I have any kind of right to in this game, mostly because of the Nintendo Gallery side quest, because you get to know the names of all the people and the enemies and stuff doing that. Shut up. But I guess he is an alright guy. <laughs> oh. You're awesome! I know who I am. But thanks for reminding me of that. Yeah, I get messages about that every day. Not that I agree with all of them. Or any of them, but... Oh. Oh, I think it started raining outside just now, actually. That sucks. Oh, look at Link standing over there. He's got his hands on his hips. He's like, mm-mm. What are you doing hiding behind this gravestone? I don't know if that's necessarily a gravestone. It's probably just a shrine or something. Because I don't know why this guy would be practicing his dance moves in front of a gravestone, unless he's really sadistic or something. Alright. Oh, we caught Pigface. Gah, you got me! 
Yeah, that guy reminds me of Lord of the Flies for some reason. Isn't there like a boy named Pig in that in that movie? God, I remember like way back in eighth grade, we actually watched that movie. Well, we were supposed to watch it. We watched like the first part and just never came back to it. It's the mo it's the one movie that I've seen part of and never the rest of it. Seriously. Maybe we should go back and watch it sometime. I've heard it's pretty brutal though, so I don't know. Not that I have like a stomach made of uh, wool here, but I don't necessarily have a stomach made of iron either, so. Aw, oh, Leem! <laughs> oh, we caught all four of you, dicks. Oh! On Matrix. I can't believe it. You found all four of us. Wait, that's not his voice. You found all four of us, and you caught us all too. Talk about utter defeat. It looks like we lost our touch, killer bees. I guess maybe it's time we chilled out. From now on, we won't cause no more trouble for no one. For anyone, I mean. And to reward your hide and seeking skills, here, take this, bud. Oh, a piece of heart. That's not what I was expecting at all. Ha <laughs> ha. That's three so far. Three down, 49 to go. I don't think there's 52 heart pieces in this game, but... Uh, this is our favorite possession, but you've proven that you're worthy. To our bud, the hide-and-seek master. hip hip hurrah! Oh, and one more thing. We need you to apologize for Miss Marie to us, alright? We're counting on you, bud. Are you too noble to do it yourself? Do I have to do everything around this joint? Well, I guess I have no choice, do I? Oh... Man. Oh, there's a bunch of books over here. Man, that's a lot of books for kids in, like, kindergarten or whatever. I don't know. I guess they could be picture books. What can I do for you on this fine day? That was a weird camera zoom. I don't know if anyone else noticed that but me. You did it, didn't you? You said something to those delinquents for me, didn't you, dear? Dude, there's still that tapping in my ear, and I don't know what to do. You can't fool me. I watched all this shadow from. I watched it all from the shadow of my door. You really are a dear. You fill me with joy. I have to reward you. See, here's a little spare change. Ooh, 50 rupees, purple rupee. That's just great. Yeah, so that might help if you're having trouble with that uh, battleship minigame. Oh, and one more thing. Don't tell anybody, dear. It's a secret to everyone. What can I do for you on this fine day? We need to talk for a third time. When it comes to children, my eyes never deceive me. Someday, dear, you will grow up to be a fine young man, and your name will go down in history. That's what I think, dear. You might be confusing me with Rudolph there, but I appreciate the sentiment. I don't know. Oh, does she have some divine power that allows her to predict that kind of thing? 25 minutes. <laughs> oh. Hey, sounds like you apologized to the teach for us. Good old Miss Marie. And speaking of, bud, did you know it's going to be Miss Marie's birthday soon? Boss, ooh, boss. You think maybe we should give her some kind of present or something? Don't be stupid. We're the killer bees. We ain't got, we ain't no teacher's pets. Yeah, but teach loves jewelry and junk more than anything else in the world. That's what she's into these days. What'd you call them? Joy pendants? Oh, I have one of those. Really? Where'd you find them? Are they just lying around? If we could find some, and maybe we could give them the teachers a present, and she'd be all happy. Hey, now that I think about it, when I was climbing trees the other day, I saw some sparkly light on top of some tree in town. I kid you not. Where was that? Maybe that's one of the pendants. What do you think, Ross? Nah, that's crazy talk. <laughs> oh, I, I caused, like... I don't know. I used so many different voices there, none of which made any sense whatsoever. Uh, I don't know if you'll actually look at the top of this tree if you'll see anything. I can't see anything from here because it's a pretty bad angle. But this is the one with the joy pendant in it. So just roll into that and get yourself another one. So that's two for us. I guess this is supposed to be your first joy pendant, but normally it's not for me. Oh, I don't know. Yo, bud! Looks like you found yourself a joy pendant. Solid work. Just like Solid Snake. Actually, I gotta admit, we had that we hid that thing up in a tree. We thought you might find it. Well, you little monkeys! Listen up, it's gonna be Miss Marie's birthday soon. We're thinking of giving her a present, so so it was good we finally got our hands on that thing. But we can't be going around giving presents to people. No way, that just don't fit the killer bee style. Come on, bud, can't you give it to teach for us, can't you? It's not like we could we, we could ask just anybody to do it for us, neither. It's got to be someone reliable. Someone who can keep a secret. Someone we just met five minutes ago! <laughs> oh my god. Really? 
Well, I guess I don't have much of a choice anyways, so I'm gonna have to uh, give that joy pendant to her. Did I ever talk to these little girls? I don't know if I did. What? Can't you see we're busy? I know it's a cute and Wait, what are you busy doing anyways? Are you picking flowers? <laughs> Doesn't look like it. Jeepers! Don't know when it's the last time I read the word jeepers. What's the matter, mister? Why are you looking at us like we're aliens or something weird like that? What? We're good little girls. We don't spread rumors. I don't know why every little kid that I've met in this game so far, I've given like a New Jersey accent. Dude, this is the, like the second time you've talked to me when I didn't want to. Okay, I, I've had enough of your shit. I've had enough of your shit. And something else I've noticed wandering around this island is that one guy said that he got his three pet pigs, and that one of them was black spotched. But it looks like they're all black spotched to me. I don't know. Maybe I'm just... Maybe I've seen the same one three times in three different places, but it seems highly unlikely that that would happen. Alright, so what do we got here? We got our joy pendants in this bag. Two of them, in fact. Here you go. Happy birthday! It was my birthday yesterday. My dear, that's a joy pendant! To tell you the truth, I love jewelry above all else, and that, why that is extremely rare and hard to come by. It's the hottest thing around, dear. Dude, get your face out of my place, teacher! Look how close she is to the camera. Oh my god, yes, I will happily take it. Take a single one from you. No, no, I insist, only one. To tell you the truth, I'd actually like about tw 20! But that would probably have only happen in my wildest of dreams. You know, I've been a teacher here for a long time. It's tough to put, a pa put one past me. That being said, I'm pretty sure I know who put you up to this, dear. Those little sweeties. I'm so joyful. It's the best birthday present I could ask for. I suppose I ought to thank you. Close your eyes, dear. Oh, 20 rupees. That's a pleasant surprise. <laughs> I was about to say that's just great, but that's actually purple rupees. And if you see those boys again, tell them I say hello. Alright. There's a sign over here. Can I read it? Uh, no, but I can sidle. Oh my god. <laughs> this is hilarious. I can just sidle in this one corner of the classroom. Oh. 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 I'm trying to peek inside this block of wood, but it's not working. Alright. Oh, look at these pictures, though. These nice little paintings. That's something that I would paint, too, in kindergarten. It's so funny. I don't know if they are in kindergarten or not. Of course, Ivan looks a lot more badass than he does in real life. Alright. Oh, no, I'm breaking the pots. I'm breaking the pots. Oh, I'm going crazy. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, sweet. Dude, what are you doing? I don't know why I'm just exploring this school. Wait, I can read this, though. Words of joy. Breathe deep and read it loud and proud. Loud and proud? Okay, here we go. <gasps> joy is hidden in all places of the world. You must widen your eyes and search for it. The first joy you find earns you a present. With 20, you become a joy steward. With 40, you have the look of a hero. Aren't all of these things joyous? Me, you, will all be full of joy. Okay, I never knew that was there, actually. That's a nice little hint to what you have to do. So you bring your 20 joy pendants later on, and you'll, she'll give you something. And then 40 after that, and she'll give you something else. Neither of those rewards are really useful. I think the 21 is actually required, but uh, don't hold me to that. I might be wrong.